Hey YouTube family, how's your day going? Mine is going fine. I went to the hospital emergency room earlier today because my leg was in so much pain. I've been like this for since Thursday when my daughter was here. But I'm okay, no blood clot or nothing. So, so it was uh, um, something with the tendon or the ligament or the muscles, but no blood clot. So. That can be relieved with Motrin or Aleve. So, I just took two Aleve, but I'm still hurting. But I'm okay. Alright, I'm getting ready to fix some Lazy Folks Soul Food. Okay, this is what I'm using. Now, y'all stay tuned, because I want to play my music after this. <laughs> okay, this is what I'm using. I'm using the Glory Mixed Greens. I mix it with the Glory Turnip Greens. I love turnip greens a lot. And you don't even need another seasoning with this. I just put a, a little bit of hot sauce in my dish. This has to warm up, so I got it in the pot. It has peppers and got everything in it. And it's good eating. Okay, I'm using Jiffy cornbread mix. So I didn't have milk. So I put one egg in it and I used what I had. My daughter left some heavy whipping cream here. So that's what I used. So I mixed it up. I'm going to put it in the pot tins because I ain't going to wash nothing. And what else? Oh, I marinated some chicken wings last night. So, I used a little balsamic vinegar. Of course, I used my yellow mustard, black pepper. My onion and my garlic powder and some tahini. Okay, I didn't use salt. And I'm gonna uh, cook that in the air fryer. And after it's done, then I'm gonna uh, put barbecue sauce on it and cook it in the air fryer for another couple of minutes. And I'm also going to cook this in my air fryer, my uh, cornbread. I'll be back. Try not to make it so long. Okay, y'all, I'm back. And I took the basket out. See here? I'm going to put the pans in the, the bottom basket. And it fits. I saw uh, somebody named Shanana. She did that. She fixed some banana nut bread or something. So, I checked it first to make sure I can pull this out. See? Okay. Plug it in. And I'm going to cook this for uh, at 400 for 20 minutes. Of course, I don't have to turn cornbread. So we're going to see how this turns out, y'all. This is a first for me, but I've seen it done. And I do feel air. So we'll see what happens. In the meantime, I prepared this one. Got my parchment paper in there. See what I'm doing. Like I said, I've already marinated this chicken. Oh, it smells so good. I'll just wait for that to get done. Okay, y'all, I'm smelling this cornbread, so I'm going to check it. Hope it ain't getting too black on the top. 
so let's see how I'm opening this. I smell it. Oh, it's not done yet. You all see that? It's rising nicely. Okay, it's still kind of jiggly, but it's real brown on the top. I think it can finish cooking. And I forgot to tell you, I also put this in my marinade. This kind of hot sauce I've been buying lately, Valentina Mexican hot sauce. It's from uh, I bought it from Aldi. I'm not sure what I paid, but I saw it in Walmart for a dollar eighty-seven cent for this giant bottle. Look at that. And this hot sauce sticks to your food. It's real thick and has a good flavor. So that's what gave my chicken the orange color. Like that, that plus the mustard, plus the balsamic vinegar. And this is the barbecue sauce I'm going to put on it after it's done. And I'm going to throw it back in the air fryer for maybe three minutes. Let this barbecue sauce bake on it. I'll be back. Okay, y'all. I had put another, okay, I checked it after 20 minutes, and it was it was still jiggly. So, let me show you what I did. I put another five, let it cook another five minutes. So, let's see. Let me show you what I did. I put a pan. I put a pan on top of it. Another pie tin. Put this on it to weigh the pan down. Let me get this out of here because it's this hot. Take this. I put the upside down pie tin. Another pie tin. See that? This hot. Let's see. This cornbread is done. done. So it took 25 minutes in the air fryer. Still got this hospital thing on. Let me take this mess off. We'll drop this. This is what it looks like. It's quite dark, but uh, it's edible. Let me put it on the stove. Okay. This is already hot, so put this in here. This is my chicken. Of course, I could have done it much faster in the oven. Put the chicken and the cornbread together in the oven, but I'm trying new things. And I'm not heating up my house. I got the air conditioning on because it is hot outside. Okay, I'm gonna cut this cornbread and see how it looks. Still hot. Turn up. Cut another piece. I don't want no raggedy cornbread. I don't have a cake slicer. So let me get up under it. Alright, y'all.
Uncle Chuck, give me no thumbs down because it's tearing up. It tastes the same. It's soaked all the way through. Let's see. Soak all the way through. Mm. It's good. Mm. Mm -hmm. I don't eat it all. I ain't took no picture of it. <laughs> but it is good. See, it's so... I'm proud of it. Mash that up with my greens. Mm-hmm. Okay. I'll be back when I'm through cooking the chicken. This is my air fried Jiffy Mix cornbread. It's nice and moist. I had to invert another pan on top of it to keep it from burning while the rest of it cooked. Then I had to put this thing on top of the inverted pan. So that's what it looks like. And it's moist and good, and the crust is good. Okay, about to stop it. Look at it. Yeah, it got dark, and it's baked on. Let me bring this over to the stove. I was burning myself. Put that in a pan. And what would have made this uh, food, this dinner, perfect would have been some sweet potatoes, candied sweet potatoes, or candied yams, and the ear corn, sliced up tomatoes, and some chopped up onions. This is what some of the chicken looks like. And me with my country self. Greens. I'm gonna be country country today, y'all. Uh, eating out of a pot tin. And if I had a jelly jar, I would drink out of it. Three wings. Okay, this is my complete dinner. I air fried the cornbread. I air fried the barbecue glazed chicken wings. And these are my glory greens. We got red pepper and they don't need nothing, but I'm gonna put a little hot sauce in here for my greens. Okay, if you like this video. Give me a thumbs up, leave a nice comment, and subscribe to my channel. Okay, here's a close up. Y'all need to taste these greens. If you haven't tried them, don't knock them. Here, take a bite. Bye, y'all. Have a blessed day.